welcome back to my channel simply family how you're doing today i hope you all are having an amazing day hope you have an amazing week as well thank you all so much for your likes thank you for your comments thank you for your subscriptions thank you to my old and my new subscribers i appreciate you all god bless you all So for today's video, it's about how to wear mask with makeup and glasses. You all know that when we wear our glasses with a with our mask, especially with our use uh, medicated glasses, you know, recommended glasses, um, it it tends to fog when you talk, you breathe, and it became very cloudy. It takes a while before it clears. I've experienced that, and I've used several types of mask. And I've always having the same problem every now and then. I even went ahead and tried a method I saw that somebody put um, uh, um, a salvage in the middle of the mask in order to protect, you know, just to create a kind of a barrier between the uh, mask and the uh, nose and the way we breathe or whatever. That didn't work as well. So when I came across this very breathable mask, and this is a kind of our uh, era right now, that's what's that's how we're living now like we have to wear mask everywhere we're going so i thought why don't to bring you guys this amazing uh mask that i purchased online then i had to go back to the store to get more because i was like surprised there was no fogging my glasses was not fogging anymore and um it was breathable that's the most important thing breathable mask very very breathable so that's the reason why i came up with this and again i wanted to see how it's gonna work with makeup bear in mind i don't wear makeup to work all right but this i already like i'm gonna show you as we continue to watch this video and let you see how i practicalize it this is the whole entire makeup that i've done i'm gonna try the next step to see how this foundation transfer or not with the new one all right if this is a topic that you find very interesting and you want to see the end results please do continue watching if so if today is your first time coming across my channel please do not forget to subscribe and do turn on your notification post so as to get notified whenever i upload so without wasting much of your time guys let's jump right into this video <music> This mask honestly I'm not about to lie to you guys you know me when I review I will tell you the good stuff about the product is good or not like I've been using mask this has been the only one that I find out that it's very very breathable I am not kidding with you guys I had to go buy go back to buy another one and it's right here in the bag I've not even opened it of course it's by Victoria's Secret this one came with my purchase online and when I try it I was like no I have to go back to the store to go buy more because it is very breathable I'm telling you so I'm about testing it if it, I can wear because I don't wear makeup with I don't really wear makeup to work anyway I just do my brows and I'm good to go with lip gloss but since we are in this era of wearing mask we don't know how long it's gonna be and some days you want to go out okay so it's uh five minutes now all right so i'm gonna go ahead and uh, put on the mask and let's see this is how it looks without me uh without makeup right now you see how clean the inside is actually i used this to work yesterday that's to tell you like i said i don't wear mask i don't wear makeup to work 
but um there's no makeup in there so i'm gonna go ahead okay to see how we can okay so this is it right now on my face if anything transferred there it might be from this powder i'm not expecting transfer from the foundation but i'm gonna take it off and let you guys see how it is right now well see not bad so the stain you all are looking at is from the powder from the bridge of my nose not bad it transferred a little bit but i'm gonna go ahead and of course i have more of the powder though i have more of the powder the powder that i used to highlight of course because i'm still in the middle of this this makeup so what i'm gonna do right now so as not to prolong this video you know i'm always about this i'm gonna go ahead and finish up the old look then we're gonna try it again and see how it looks and i will show you the other pair that i bought from the store then we'll wrap up this video all right so now guys welcome back let me put it like that you know welcome back you all have seen the practical one the first part one i mean part one of it while i did that so now we're going to do you know jump into the concluding part so this is the second mask this is the first one that we tried on and yeah let me quickly talk about this mask look at it it has an adjustable band like you can adjust it to whatever length you want it to go like this it's like one size fit all kind of mask you see and they have it right here the other side too and whatever they use to make the inside honestly i don't know because it's very breathable i am not kidding to you guys of course it has a a victoria secret uh, logo right here if you don't want this the other one that i purchased doesn't have a oh no very visible for me i don't mind i don't mind wearing this i even like it because it's uh, i even like it because it's a uh, it's a uh, black and gold i love the color combination so we're gonna try you know this is the first one we used to try while i was you know experimenting with the foundation alone and now this is the entire face so now we're going to try it with the new one that i just purchased from the store these are masks they are sold for ten dollars so or this is the second one that i went back to the store to purchase that one the other one i bought it online with some other stuff okay so i will go ahead and open it so we're going to give this a try so oh man this one is completely different like i prefer the one i bought online but let me show you guys see so i, I this one has an adjustable thing going on as well but the inside is this color like yeah i've not tried this one i don't know of course it should be breathable but i think i'm loving the other one better than this time i end up going back to buy that one because really i like the shape of that one and you see their pink uh stuff right here so i'm gonna go ahead and put it on let's see this is we testing the makeup with it then we'll test the glasses and we wrap wrap up this video okay okay honestly guys this is breathable too it's breathable but to some extent i i don't really find this uh a lot more comfortable compared to the first one okay so i'm gonna go ahead and bring it out let's see how many transfer we have not that bad see look at that guys not that bad let me go ahead and put it again i really like the first one compared to this one though i'm not gonna lie well this one is not bad not bad at all i can breathe yeah i can breathe with it too but i love the other one maybe because of the uh, gold uh, the black and gold thing going on and how it looks i'll put it on for you guys to see that's the one we're going to be trying the glasses with so this is it yeah then let me bring it out again not that bad and the foundation that i use the idea is the foundation you're going to use is not that bad it transferred a little bit but not that bad okay you don't have to wear makeup with your glasses but if you want to the idea is use a, a, a foundation that claims it, it doesn't transfer one make sure you use your matte uh, matte uh, primer that's what i use i use this primer it's matte and i use a uh, setting spray that it's matte as well and the foundation that i use is by car from d is non-transfer that's what the foundation claim and i make sure i use their um concealer as well under my eye which is the same one that co that goes with this particular lock it's a foundation this is lock it's a concealer as well both of them are the same thing yes lock, lock it concealer so you use something that said is non-transferable 
all right then i said it with a powder that is matte as well so that's the idea if you want to wear uh makeup with your mask but just be assured that some product are going to transfer all right some are going to transfer because you use other product that doesn't claim it doesn't transfer remember so the only thing that will not you will not really see is the foundation because that doesn't transfer but all that product are going to transfer so if you want to wear makeup with your mask i would recommend you use foundation that says not transferable but for me i don't really think i want to do that except i mean it's not bad but if you want to do so let's go back let's go to the other part of it and see how it's going to prevent my glasses from fogging if you all notice when i breathe you see fog around the glasses and when you talk it's all going to come all over that you become blurry okay so we are testing that part out so i lost the clip to the one i recorded in the makeup room so this is me showing you guys how this mask is so comfortable to wear with the glasses you all can see that it went all the way to the bridge of your nose so there's no way it can be foggy like when you talk Compared to the ones I've used in the past, this mask is so comfortable, guys. So that's what I just wanted to show you. Like, I couldn't find I just got off work. Like, just got in off work right now. And I'm about heading home. So I said, oh, let me use this opportunity to shoot this. It's so hot. Like, super, super hot right now.